So check this out. This horseshoe has been sitting here so long, it's just rusting out. Like, I, I don't even want to move it because it wants to break. This may have been sitting here since the time it was thrown here. Who knows how long ago? And check it out. These ones are actually almost full. Almost four horseshoes found in one spot. That means someone might have been de-shoeing their horse right here. I don't know what is up with this hole or when this hole was dug or, or why this is here, but uh, there's just so much stuff around here. It's really interesting. Look at this old square bottle. That is not anything that's common today. The glass is too thin. Uh, there's nothing that's shaped like that. All these old bottles you can see where those were uh, cork tops, really cool. Check it out, it's some kind of tool or hook or of some sort. I wonder what it was used for. An old can of sardines. Looks like it was never even opened. Or maybe it was, I don't know. Yeah, maybe right there. Check it out, the top two, some kind of old like tincture bottle or something of some sort. Too bad I couldn't find the whole thing. Part of an old spoon. sure how old this bottle is but it's still almost all the way complete and bottom of I don't know maybe a, some kind of bottle it's kind of cool a few more other bottoms there all right so check it out this pit is a kind of interesting um, one there's some bones here they look pretty old anyone uh, Anyone know what kind of animal those probably are? Maybe a dog or something. There's some other old bones here too. That looks like a cattle bone. Oh, there's some, whoa, there's some teeth. Dang, look at these. I just found some teeth. There's bones here. There's another bone right here. creepy there's some more over there alrighty guys so check it out this is the first structure um, looks like some really cool masonry work that seems to be almost melting into itself Let's see if we can look at any of those pictures and uh, See if there's anything that this building would have re uh, resembled. All right, guys, so check it out. Oh, look at the stone uh, patio here. Oh yeah, that was a huge lizard too. Yep, some tweaker out here tweaking. Well, that's interesting. It's just like a pit full of stuff. But it's like, it goes like way down in there as if someone was digging for something here and then filled it in. Cause they didn't want anybody to get in it. But look at this. This whole thing has collapsed. You could see where I probably had some kind of cellar of some sort. The stone foundations, really nice foundations though, I mean, in my opinion. Um, yeah, this town was a, a pretty booming big place back in the day. Let's check out the front. Let's check out more uh, stone foundation, some kind of box. 
this would have been the front entryway. Yep, but this one's completely collapsed. Looks like part of an old fireplace here or something. Anyways, I think there's a cemetery out there. We're gonna go take a look at that. Check it out, this little glass top to a bottle. It's pretty cool. Alrighty guys, so check it out. We are at a lot of unmarked graves. They all look to be unmarked. something got into there whoa something got into this like big time some kind of animal that's creepy zombies alrighty guys so that is where I'm gonna end today's video thanks for coming along with me on the adventure there wasn't too much to see out here but we still got to find some cool stuff in this pretty much unvisited, for the most part, ghost town. But uh, if you like videos like that, this, hit that like button. And if you want to follow along in the future, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys out there next time.